All right, so I am Preston Black, and this is our reading assessment week two assignment for ITL 514, and I am with Mackenzie, who is going to be taking the assessments today. She is a sixth grade student. Okay, so the first one that we are going to go over is the interest inventory. So, Kenzie, I'm going to read you um, some questions and just go ahead and answer them orally, please. Okay? All right, so the first question or the first response is, I enjoy blank. I enjoy playing softball. I enjoy playing softball. Very good. All right, the second one. My favorite subject in school is? Um, my favorite subject in school is English. English. Good choice. Number three. When I read, I like to read? Dork Diaries. Dork Diaries. Never heard of it. All right, next one is I like to spend time? With my family. Oh, good one. With my family. Five. My favorite thing in the world is? Is my friends. My friends. It's nice to have friends. My hobbies are? Playing softball and singing. Ooh, singing. Maybe after this you could sing us a song. No. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> All right. Um, number seven. I like to write about? I like to write about... What I do in my free time. Okay. Very good. All right, number eight. When I finish school, I want to be? A doctor. Ooh, a doctor, nice. What kind of doctor? A RN nurse. Also a nurse, okay. My favorite television shows are? Fuller House. Oh, good choice. And Disney shows. Not any particular Disney shows? Nope. Okay, all Disney shows. All right, I would like to learn more about? I would like to learn more about science. Science, okay. And number 11, last one. I would like to spend more time in school. I like to spend more time in school. Um. Doing, um, I spend more time in school. Having fun. Having fun. Well, you can do that. Okay. School is always fun. Okay, very good. So that was um, our first interest survey. So the next one that we are going to do is the reading attitude survey. So this is just going to gauge um, what you like to do when reading um, and when you like to do it, okay? So on the page, there are four different Garfields, right? Um, you have happy Garfield, slightly smiling Garfield, mildly upset Garfield, and very upset Garfield, okay? And um, whenever I read the question, you'll just circle which one um, you feel like, okay? Okay. All right, so our first one is how do you feel when you read a book on a rainy Saturday? So just um, go ahead and circle the one. C. Okay. You don't have to tell me, just go ahead and circle it and I'll we'll look at it after. Okay. How do you feel when you read a book in school during free time? Got it? All right. How do you feel about reading for fun at home? Got it? All right. How do you feel about getting a book for a present? All right. How do you feel about spending free time reading? Okay. How do you feel about starting a new book? Okay. How do you feel about reading during summer vacation? Oh, we're in summer vacation right now. Hopefully you're doing some reading. How do you feel about reading instead of playing? I 
I noticed how you like to play softball. So maybe you can read some books about softball. How do you feel about going to a bookstore? We don't have a lot of bookstores anymore. But we still have a library at school, huh? How do you feel about reading different kinds of books? So like mysteries, um, fiction, nonfiction, things like that. Okay, how do you feel when the teacher asks you questions about what you read? All right, how do you feel about doing reading workbook pages and worksheets? Okay. Got it. How do you feel about reading in school? Are you confident? Got it, all right. How do you feel about reading your school books? So like your textbooks. Got it? All right. How do you feel about learning from a book? Okay. Okay, all right, good. How do you feel when it's time for reading class? Okay. How do you feel about the stories you read in reading class? How do you feel when you read out loud in class? How do you feel about using a dictionary? Okay. All right, and last one. How do you feel about taking a reading test? Okay. Got it? Yes. All right, very good. So now that we are done with the elementary reading attitude survey we are going to go on to the San Diego quick reading assessment okay so I'm gonna go ahead and hand you some sheets um, they're gonna have different grade level words on them so I have a sheet for um, each grade and then you will read each word um, off of the sheet and then we will um, you just keep going until I say stop then if once you complete that grade level then we'll go ahead and move on to the next one okay so you're gonna read them in sequence and then you are going to oh, technical difficulties there we go all right, there we go. <clears throat> All right, so since you are in sixth grade, we are going to start two grade levels below. Um, so we were going to go ahead and start with grade four. Okay, so here is grade four. And then just go ahead and read the words off of the sheet, and um, then we'll... Move on. Okay. All right. Go ahead. Decided. Served. Amazed. Silent. Wrecked. Improved. Certainly. Entered. Realized. Interrupted. All right. Good. So that was all the words for grade four. You did a very good job this time. Can you just read them a little bit slower? Okay. So now we are going to grade five. So go ahead and read the words that are on grade five. Scanty. Okay. Business. Business. Develop. Okay. Considered. Okay. Discussed. Behaved. Behaved. Good job. Splendid. Good. Acquainted. Escaped. And grim. And grim. Dang, you're just flying through these. Good job. All right, so that was grades four and grade five. Now we are going to grade six. Okay. So here are the words for grade six. There you go. 
And go ahead and let me get my paper ready. All right, go ahead and start reading. Bridge, commercial, abolish, Good. trucker, apparatus, elementary, comment, necessity, gallery, relativity. Okay. So since you did such a good job on grade six, you're gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and give you grade sevens too. So a whole grade level um, above where you were at. Okay, so here is grade number seven. Great job so far. All right, go ahead. Amber. Dominion. Sundry. Capillary. Imperious. Blight. Rest. Enumerate. Daunted. Consent. All right, great job, Kenzie. We're going to go ahead and stop at grade um, seven. Okay, so if we look at the assessment, you were able to um, make it all the way through grade seven. Okay, um, so grade seven was your frustration level, okay, because you had um, missed three or more, um, but it was just three. But your instructional level would be sixth grade, because you missed two on uh, sixth grade. Okay, but other than that, you did a great job. Okay, thank you for being here today. And um, we'll continue with the other assessments, um, but for the recording, um, that is it. All right, thank you.